Do you like this? Do you like this? <laughs> well. What do you mix with? Yeah, like yeah. what's your ethnic? Yeah. Background? Mom is Indian and then my dad is white, so mm. Indian. Huh? I'm mm. half Korean, half white. It's so weird to say I'm half. Like, really? You're not. You're actually not. That's not how that works. You're just, you're, you're a mix of both but anyway whatever what do i know <laughs> kind of suspicious of daria and we think chat the hair i felt like it was kind of a distraction like as i know it could be, it could be i and you know what if she i swear to god dog if that <laughs> if that is the imposter she need to get slapped for real what the fuck? she is tall as shit met at a movie theater my mom was working there and my dad like came in and he just had a crush on her so he'd always keep coming back and just watching movies creepy so, like, my mother was an international student Probably international not. student you threw that in there yeah. <laughs> I didn't see it. you mentioned international students so i thought she was targeting me so i thought mm, okay maybe she's the mole my parents yeah she is school. she's so he tall in the military so he was in osan air base in south korea believe and that my mom was at that barbecue because she lived near osan she would tell me about it, she was like, yeah, I thought Americans were really weird because your dad showed up in shorts and flip-flops and a button-up tee <laughs> with like a Russian bear hat and it was winter. A Russian bear hat is crazy. Like, yeah. <laughs> My parents met in LA, which is like the in missing LA. Spot, so. Her parents had met in LA. So she didn't That's really all she said. On that. Right. Everyone else had kind of gone into more- Hannah, Hannah, you my <laughs> Hannah, Hannah. I get it. She's the fucking mole chat. Tale about their parents and I felt like that was a little strange. So it opinion. is. Um, I would say it Her eyebrows. Party. In reservation. <laughs> We got through the questions. Okay. Why are you laughing about it? She must be nervous. Daria. Caitlin. I was Caitlin. just noticing that she seemed nervous and she didn't have a lot of details. <laughs> Ella. On the most simplistic standpoint. Get her out of here. The Get her out of here. Obviously, it's not truly about that. Get her out of here. We have a Goodbye. tie. Oh, oh wow. shit. It's a tie. Between Ella, Caitlin, and Daria. So my hair, I have an afro normally, but it's all braided and I added in extensions just because it's easier, but I have four B curls, which I would only know if I was mixed. I what? <laughs> Excuse me? You would only know about hair if you were mixed because, you know, why, you know, every other person can't fucking Google that bitch. I get that from my dad. Everything else is white because, I mean, my dad's half Belgian and half black. And then my mom's fully white, so I just unfortunately am Xerox paper and I don't even tan. But it's all in my hair, I promise. My sister and I are kind of the palest what my brother actually looks like he's black. Um, so yeah, it's a weird liminal space to be in. It happens. That happens. That happens. You can get all kinds of shades and colors and different variations because you are mixing a lot of things together. And so there's a lot of different possibilities. Genetics is beautiful that way. Mom is from the Navajo Nation Reservation. Um, and my dad is Mexican. He just grew up in Arizona. So, you know, I have equal balances in both, I guess. No, that's not how genetics work. <laughs> Started, you know, kind of giggling or laughing in her story. And I thought, hmm, there's something suspicious here. She's nervous. I think she. I think she's nervous. Oh, they got her. Why ain't they get Doria? Talking to really, yeah. really. The they fell for that. I thought, you know, might have gotten me voted out. Nah. Raise your hand if you think the mole is still in the box and you'd wish to continue the game. It's Daria. I have a question. Oh. Um, or like, or sorry, like, cause you're you're a quarter, right? Oh, oh, that's what it's called. Oh, yeah. That's good to know. <laughs> <laughs> my back I never heard of that. What the fuck? I have a younger sister who's like the color of Rihanna, and then my brother is super tan. And so then there's me, white girl with a giant afro, and people are always like, "How is your hair so frizzy?" I'm like, "Well, it's curly. It's an afro." You know, explaining to people like who I am. It was hard at times, <laughs> but then I also was really proud that I got to say like, "Oh, I'm part black. Like that's why I have this cool hair." But it took me a you are black you are black you are black you are white supposedly that's what she's saying anyway it's it's so weird to say you're part something and i don't like i feel like people don't <laughs> fucking realize what they're saying you are both bro you are both you're just as much this 
as you are that. You are a mix of both. Part is so fucking weird to say. One thing I felt is like, I've actually been to India like multiple times and whenever I go, I'm like the lightest one there. So I just don't feel Indian at all, really. He said oh that my he'd God. been to Poor India children. and he just kind of threw that out there. And that felt really quick and just like, a, but there wasn't any detail to the story. Oh, yeah, shut up. Imposta. Like so thing, tall, like, I can't get over it. I would always get like made fun of a lot by like other Korean students who would mm. say like, there's like slurs for like biracial people. Um, mm -hmm. And so it was always like, oh, people like you just shouldn't exist and stuff like that. Oh, so Jesus I, Christ. You know, I grew up in predominantly white neighborhoods my whole life. I don't speak Spanish. I don't speak Navajo. I never had a quinceanera. <laughs> so I'm not really like 100% in like each culture. For that me, doesn't, yeah, up, but not all Mexican folks have quinceaneras and not all Mexican folks know how to speak Spanish, especially if you were born here. It depends on how you were raised. That has nothing to do with like, like no culture is just one thing. You got a fucking spectrum. People are people at the end of the fucking day. And it, it all depends on how you were raised, how your parents raised you and that varies from household to household among each culture to culture. Not Get rid of Daria. Sorry, my camera. <laughs> well, they got, they got rid of him. Come I'm on, y'all falling for that him? bullshit? I swear to God. When the group eliminated Devin, I think we found them all. I think we're good now. Oh yeah, Which sure, mole. That means you have voted the mole out and you all win. Let's go, red. However, if the lights turn red, that means the mole is still in the box. Redder than a bit. And he leaves. <laughs> Let's go chat, it's red. <laughs> oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Do you like this? Do you like this? <laughs> well, no more. <laughs> Gas money for everybody. Yeah. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Gas money, Please damn. Please reveal themselves <gasps> in three, two, Is it Devin? Oh, it might be, one. it's her. Ah! I'm Lebanese. Oh. <laughs> <Arab> <laughs> Middle Eastern. Which is technically white. In the US, people from North Africa, so like Egypt, Tunisia, Algeria, etc., and people from the Middle East are considered white on the US census. So Why? it really goes really? to show how arbitrary. What? Really? I didn't know that. But then it says etc. Like what the fuck? This is really interesting and I want to like look more into this. This is fucking weird. <laughs> the term white is in the ways in which it's applied to people. Mm -hmm. I always think it's silly that on the census it's, you know, black, white, Asian. The categories mm -hmm. are so limited. Mm -hmm. And so when I'm doing the census, I just put white because I look like I'm white. It just goes to show you. What? Interesting. So you want to be connected to your cult, your both of your cultures, the cultures in which you are composed of, but you don't on paper. Interesting. I'll tell you that no matter what somebody looks like, like you could be biracial, like your hair. I would have thought, okay, I, I could believe that you're mixed because you have the curly hair, but you, you never know. Any fucking race can have curly hair. He's so stupid.